You've got to take action on this issue. I mean, there are people smugglers. These are criminals. Well, they are perpetrating an evil, and we've got to do something about it. And for those people who are blocking or attempting to block the Rwanda bill going through uh, the House, I would say that um, unless they're able to put forward some credible alternative as a deterrent, then they should let me deploy this alongside the other things that we're doing mm. to, to deter people from making this crossing, to break the business model of these people smuggling gangs. What's your message to Keir? Because he says he's going he's to tear this policy up if it comes into force and he gets into number 10. Well, look, I, I, the, the thing that really strikes me about the Labour front bench is they are attempting to perpetrate a con on the British people. So they're talking tough and yet when push comes to shove, when it actually comes to voting for stuff, they have voted against every single measure to tighten uh, our borders. So they, they, they say they're going to break uh, the people smuggling uh, gangs. That's a con, because they have uh, voted against the legislation that we use to do that. They say that they are going to uh, uh, cooperate internationally. That's a con, because they know we are already doing it. What I've said to the Labour front bench is that this newfound fervour for border control is in sharp contrast, sharp contrast with the, all the actions they have taken. They voted against it again and again and again and the British people, they can see it's a con and they can see through it.